y'all and welcome back to my channel. My name is Kathy and on this channel we do do some fashion hauls, product reviews, and a little bit of cooking here and there. If you like any of that stuff, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the little bell notification so you can be notified any time that I do upload a new video. Also, if you like this video, please give me a big thumbs up. I greatly appreciate it. Today I do have for you a Shein haul. I love Shein. I am a Shein girl through and through. Um, and if I ever had any problems with them, the return process was not difficult at all. Today I do have some clothing items for you, as well as some um, jewelry pieces and a couple of other um, things. But anyways, let's just get on into this haul. The first thing I want to show you is this, this one's first. My niece... The other day, I mailed some stuff off to her, and I got home, and I had received some more stuff that I had ordered for her from Shein, and she loves cats. Anything, she loves cats. She loves Hello Kitty, anything anime. So I found these, and I hope that you can see them. They are kind of clear, but they are so cute, and I thought that she would really like those. And then... These ones are really cute. These are a spaceship with a cat as the driver. If you can see those. She's really gonna love these. These are so adorable. So adorable. And something kids are liking like to do nowadays is put keychains, especially girls, I think. But put keychains and stuff on their backpacks. And I found this that she could put on her backpack. I don't know if that's what she'll do with it, but it's, I wanna say I think it's a penguin, but I just thought it was so cute. And I thought, oh, I'm gonna get that one for her too. So, get, get straight, get straight, there we go. It's just, I thought, oh my goodness, that is so cute. She's gonna love it. And then, if you've seen any of my other videos, you know that we have some um, dogs. We have a, a rather large dog. We've got two pits, and then we have the the Chihuahua. She thinks she's a pit. <laughs> Anyways, if somebody knocked on our door, you would think that a bunch of crazy dogs live here. And I found this sign that says, crazy dogs live here. It's a wooden, shaped like a bone. I thought that the two paws in the corners was just too cute, too, too cute. It did come with another um, tie that you could hang it up with. I didn't really like that tie and I wanted something that felt a little bit more substantial. So I put, and I think this is called jute. I think that's what they call it. I put that on this for, to hang it up on. So, but yeah, I thought that was, that was adorable and so appropriate for our place, so. Anyways, that's it for that. So let's just get on into this. <laughs> okay, this first piece that I want to show you, I did actually haul this a couple of videos back. And when I was editing that video, I discovered that I did not push record when I had this trial for this particular <laughs> outfit. But so here it is today. It is a drop shoulder um, tee. It's that fuzzy, really cozy material. It is soft, but it does have a little bit of grip on my dry skin. It's 95% polyester and 5% elastane. It does come in a two-piece. The T is a little bit on the longer side, which I do appreciate. And I also like the length of the shorts where they hit me in the, on the legs. I think that's really nice. I really like that. Um, here's the back. It's very, very comfortable. This is great to just lounge around the house in, or if you need to go run some errands, pick up the kids, go to the bank, the grocery store. It's great to just do wear it, wear it out and about, you know. So I, I really like this outfit. It's really comfortable, and it seems like it's really good, you know, since we're in that time of year that um, it may be still a little bit cool in the mornings or later in towards the evening um, here. We had some really bad wind, so that's why my lighting is a little bit different today. Is because we did have to close the window 
or put something over the window because the wind was so bad it was bringing in um, dust. If I can get the video that I did of that, um, how much dust that it had brought in before we got the windows covered, um, I'll try to link that somewhere. I'm not sure if I'll be able to, but it was it was just bad. It was just bad. But anyways, I thought this was really cute, and I'm glad I, I did pick this up. So this is this is one of my favorite lounging outfits, and I have worn it several times since I got it. The next item I wanted to show you was these sandals that I picked up. I did pick these up in a size 41, and usually I do pick them up in a 40. So I think probably. <clears throat> when I look back at the reviews, they might have said that they ran small. That's another thing. Always know your measurements when shopping anywhere, not just Shein, but anywhere. And go by and compare your measurements to the wherever, wherever you're shopping to their sizing chart. And also look at the reviews. Those reviews are so helpful, especially if they have a picture. Those are really helpful. But I did pick these up in a 41. They do feel a little um, snug. Not long ways, but the width. They do feel a little snug in the width part. And they are a flat, so there is no arch support in these, which I don't I don't mind. I was born with flat feet, and that's all I really know. So, But I'll uh, insert a clip with the, these on them. And, um, I think I'll do that. No, no. Anyways, yeah. And here are those little sandals. Today, they don't seem as tight as they did the first time that I tried them on. The first time I tried them on, they seemed really, really, um, tight. Now, I wouldn't go running around. <clears throat> this is the first swimsuit that I wanted to show you. I think this is really really cute it does have uh, molded removable cuffs and I have noticed that they started putting the slit in the middle which that makes it I think really more easier to get the cuffs in and out also you can't sit on the outside but on the inside there seems to be a seam sewed down the middle I think that's to keep them from moving all over the place this I did get in a size 3x I don't know if I told you that already but it's a size 3x the, it does have adjustable straps, and I do have it moved pretty far up. Um, I love the print, and the color is so very vibrant. I wanted to try the shorts. The top does have adjustable sides, so you tie it up and wear them up a little bit higher, or you can wear them low. Now, the shorts, I thought the shorts would come with... Um, swimsuit bottoms like sewed on the inside kind of like men's swimsuits sw uh, bleh, bleh. men's swimsuit shorts but they do not it's just a pair of shorts so I do have a pair of um, swimming swimming bottoms underneath these shorts because um, when I turn around there seems to be like it's not firm up against their fur. It's not flush up against the skin, so there's some air. There seems to be air, you know. So I just didn't feel comfortable with just nothing underneath the shorts. So I do have some swim bottoms underneath these shorts. I think it's really cute, and I don't mind wearing the, the swim bottoms underneath. I just grabbed a pair that I had already had, but this did come in another color. It comes in just No, they have to scratch all that because it doesn't come in. I don't know if it has any other colors, really. I like this color, though. I think it is such a vibrant and pretty color. And I'm so ready for the summer to get here so I can go so swimming. Or just get out and there being no wind, that would be really nice. But, yes, this is this is definitely a keeper. I wonder if I should go down a size because the bust is a little bit too big and then there's the open areas in the shorts. So I wonder if it would help if I 
went down the size. I'm not sure. Let me know what y'all think in the comments. I'm, I'm a little lost on that part. But I love this swimsuit. I love it. I think it's so cute. This next swimsuit is a one piece. This one, I really love this one. I feel very comfortable in it. It does have the molded removable pads. I did notice that it does have the slits in the middle and the seam going down the middle as well. These straps are not adjustable, but they do have this pretty mesh in between here. Um, the top is, the top of course is a little bit big, but we need that. We already need that, so moving on. The middle has that same mesh detail and it goes down into this cute skirt. I love this one. Love, love, love it. Um, the mesh goes all the way around. Um, let's see. It does have a little trouble trying to stay down in the back, but that's because of my, my rear. Anyways, but I think this one is so cute. I love it. It is a full bottom brief or full coverage brief underneath it. I'm nothing sticking out. I just love this one. This, it, it, and it does have a little bit of compression in it. Not like the other one. Today. It didn't, the other one didn't have no compression in it. This one, I do feel a little bit of compression in it. But I think it's so cute. And the, the pattern or the fabric is got these pink flowers on it. It did come in another color, color that's just black and white. And then it had this one that had the pink flowers with it. I Hey y'all, editing Kathy here. I forgot to film my outro again. Anyways, that's all that I had for you in this Shein haul. Let me know what your favorite piece was down below. Also, I just wanted to thank everybody for clicking on my channel today. And if you haven't already, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the little bell notification so you can be notified anytime that I do upload a video. And if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. Is that great? And thank you. Thank you for clicking on my channel today. And if you have already subscribed and liked my videos, thank you again. Because I just wanted to say that I really enjoy doing these hauls. Um, when I first started out, I didn't have that many clothes at all. Um, very little. And so I really have enjoyed um, giving y'all these hauls and building up my wardrobe. I just wanted to just tell you thank you so much and have a wonderful Easter and stay safe. Mwah. And I look forward to bringing you more hauls and to the future and um, lots more to come. So that's it.